Well, I thought I'd do an update on the, uh, the gravel pit. I've pretty much dug out what I'm going to dig. Now I got to, I mean, there's still just ungodly amount of rock in here. And I've, I mean, I've dug down three feet there. This is just, it never took the gravel road out. So, I mean, I just, I had an assistant here today and I saw a little piece of concrete hanging out. And I found this thing for, 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 for scale. Oops. That's a, that's a boot for scale. You know, that's lower leg height piece of concrete. That was just today's haul. Uh, yeah, I mean, you can just see. So I don't, I, there's no way I can get, I mean, I'm, I'm going to rake it out and then I'm going to bury it all underneath clear dirt. And that's the best I can do. I mean, that's like eight inches down there. That's like six inches. I just can't do anymore. There's just no way. I did get this uh, valve adjusted. That was fun. <laughs> Had to dig a hole about four feet down right there, about three foot in diameter. And then I was able to lower that valve down or the valve cover. And I'm gonna bury the shit out of that and it'll never be seen again. I took measurements. This over here, I still not totally sure. I was hoping I could talk with my neighbor to see how he wanted to do this, but apparently he doesn't want to talk to me, so I'm just gonna have to sort it. Oops, just about fell. I'm still a couple feet short. The only problem is like where the property line is is that goalie basically. That's just gonna be garbage for him. So I don't know. I may leave a little grass there. I have no idea. I talked to his wife and asked her to send him my way so I could, uh, you know have a polite conversation about how it would be best for everyone involved, but I can't do that on my own, so I'm just gonna have to... See, for example, back dragging, I hit this thing. That's, that's just a piece of concrete, you know? And you can see all the rocks. I mean, it's just a bajillion of them. I mean, that's literally all gravel. That's just all gravel. There's nothing I can do about it. I mean, I, like when I dug that three to four foot hole over there, I found rocks at the bottom at four feet. Like if I, if I dug this all out five feet down, I would still find gravel. It would never end. It never ends. It goes forever. It looks really bad though. So I don't know. At least I'll be able to, I mean, there's a piece right there. That's, I don't, I don't, <laughs> I don't even have words, dude. Like, I've been out here digging for days, literally days. Just digging the living shit out of this thing for days. For days, kids! I mean, you can see, like, right here. That's... I've dug that down. The whole picky to thumb is excavated. This was lower. So that's, like, 10 inches I took out right there. Still gravel. There's still fucking gravel there at 10 inches down. Whatever. All right. I mean, some of these big ones... It's good ballast. I did fix my mailbox today. So the guy must have got yelled at when I bitched. So he took his, I don't know if he did it with a skid loader or whatever. He destroyed the upper part, knocked the base loose. So the whole thing was leaning this way and that way. And it took an impact from this direction. So I managed to uh, lift it. I got a forward tilt so I can in, uh, grab it and it's almost good this way. So that's. I brought fresh, uh, clear dirt packed around there because I don't want to hit that with the skid loader, so. Whatever. I'm about done for the day. Just, I realized I hadn't updated the video in a while, so. Landscape brake's going to come in really handy. Probably one of the better uh, attachments I've ever come across for one of these machines, so. I guess we'll... Let's go, uh... People are in the skid loader cam.
could just park that right there. Can't steal my trailer when there's a yard rake in the way. I might put the bucket there, but since we're already filming, I guess this is going here. Whatever. <laughs> All right. Well, there's five minutes of your life you're ever getting back. Stay safe.